Hello guys, how are you all doing? I hope that you are fine. So actually I've just returned back home right now. I believe currently it's around 8. Yes, I've just arrived. It's actually night. Kampala is full of chaos. Kampala is full of chaos. My battery died today around it was around like, I believe around 3 so I wouldn't vlog. So I had to first of all like uh do what? I had to first of all actually like charge uh, the phone before I can be able to vlog and I wouldn't vlog anything but right now I'm back at home and I want to do a mini haul yes of everything I've bought I feel like we as YouTubers and actually generally the general public we are always actually replacing things hopefully guys you can see me there yes I feel like we are always replacing things I'm trying to fix my my like to see if I'm in the frame so now for the fourth time i feel like we are always trying to fix things so do you know my extension which i would usually actually connect to the main socket because the socket is not near by my bed it's actually very far so i had that particular cable which i would connect in the main socket and use that to charge my phone and also when i'm using my computer so that's very convenient it did die i have actually not been having a cable now for some good time <laughs> that is the truth but this is a cable and i would actually charge my phones there let me show you do you see that i would put them actually there overnight so that uh in the morning when i'm going to school uh, they are fully charged and it is very inconvenient so today i say let me just go past in town pick that also if it's the last vlog or real rang ramenika so i had or oh, i wanted to actually buy a new broom like indoor broom i've also bought that then yeah, this is the first thing i want to show you guys uh, this is the broom this was 3500 start to return it also comes with this stick I know that these ones at regular shops here in Uganda they are actually around nusu around 7000 yes kasamfu but I usually buy all my things in Chikuo because I'm familiar with where people do purchase in bulk and sell at their mobile phone mobile eh mobile phones in the movie and uh so that they can sell at their retail shops so this one bobanga you are buying from a wholesale price it is 3500 but when you are buying it from any video here for example in my location it is 7000 ugandan shillings yes so i know where actually i can pick these at very very good price and this is the last thing that i did pick up and this is a uh, cable which i did tell you that i bought because the other one did blow i also actually bought this from the same location where i did from the same location where actually i did buy uh the kettle if you have seen the reset vlog uh the same location where i did buy the kettle i never got anyone who wanted the, the location so that's why i never followed up that video but this is how it does look like going on over here i've got in this one with four ports 1 2 3 4 and also the cable looks to be very very long meaning that it will be able to you know be of a good distance from where the main socket is to my bed where i usually simply and easily put my phone to charge i'm so excited that i've been able to also buy this because it has been on my mind for now some good time and lastly i did buy these gloves like cooking gloves these ones i did pick up from owino going on over here a pair of them was uh 1000 ugandan shillings bibidi there are two in here monday i'm going to be having my first paper second paper and on tuesday my third paper so i have my uniform here and it's only three days so i i don't see that the, 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 you know to wash it i don't have time even wash yes well, i have a lot of laundry in the bedroom but i'm going to be doing that laundry i believe on wednesday after the two days that is monday and tuesday of doing the theory papers and yeah so you guys let me catch you when i catch you i don't know when i'm going to be catching you but hope you let me catch you when i do probably uh when i'm eating because i've ordered some food I'm going to be eating real quick after eating start reading I have to be reading my summaries and also tomorrow it's going to be the last day of our discussions probably I'll be taking you along on our last day of our discussions it's going to be very detailed because I want to get every glimpse actually I'm also thinking about vlogging like that day of our papers yes I'll be vlogging that day of our papers I promise you guys I've actually just put it as you see 
And can you see the distance that it's slightly longer to my bed? So I usually put it here. I know someone might be there saying, Tanya, why do you sleep with a socket? You know, I put it over here and I hang it just like this. I hang it in like this and I put it here so that it's not like flowing. And I put, bring all my chargers. For example, this is uh, for this mobile phone. I put it. I'm now doing a tutorial. Just put it just like this. And yeah, it's easier, it's convenient than actually. Can you see that? Yeah, it's more, much more easier than waking up and taking the phone there and coming back. Good evening, guys, once again. I'm actually about to start reading. This is what I'm having. I already actually had supper. I'm having an added kind of snack. I don't know, but it's more like me when I'm reading. I, I want to be eating something for supper. Actually, I never showed what I ate, but this is just an admit. Hmm? Once you eat a dessert, you know, I was actually full, but I said, let me just eat this avocado because it looked like it was getting spoiled anytime. I also have some bread with, uh, bread actually has honey within it and uh, the avocado has like a uh, salad masala and some yeah and somewhat and some salt even i can't speak anyway right now i want to start reading it's currently around 10 i'm tired i think you can see it in my face but i have to sacrifice this time and read I officially have one day to the final nursing examinations. Yes, I'm very excited. I've actually been here, you know, reading and sorting out things and that and that. As you see the table. And I've also been having a discussion with one of my good friends, Leia, like an online discussion, which we have just finished right now. So right now I want to eat real quick and continue with my uh, you know, reading. Then tomorrow is a Sunday, and on Monday that's when I have the uh, papers. I have rice. Uh, I also have, uh, you know, is it this buga and avocado with some salad masala. The salad masala actually I got it from Mega Standard Supermarket. You might, you know, see that my camera is a little bit shaky. I, I'm not using a tripod, but yeah, this is my meal for now. I want to eat this real quick. Then continue with reading. As you see, the books are all over the place. I also have a glass of water going on over here. Yeah, so let me eat real quick. Uh, continue with reading and let me catch you when I do. Good evening. How are you all doing? Hope that you are fine, well and good. It's kind of cold today in Kampala. Today happens to be a Sunday, actually. Third, yes. And tomorrow is my first papers. I'm very excited to do these papers. Like, I just know it for sure deep in my heart that it's time to, you know, to finish off the paper and do something else, something big, something amazing on my to-do list. I think we're fainting. Yeah, so yeah. It is so. Did you know what you need to have some money for so much? Oh, it is so yummy. Oh, you know, we need to eat. 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 We need <laughs> Florence, you're not going to put them aside and think from those pregnant after paper. You can't wait. 
Good morning. I need your Uh, as you have been hearing the bell, I'm already done with wearing my uniform. We're having our meeting down here with, with like the sisters who are going to be supervising us. Uh, let me just see you after the paper and I'm going to make it a man and a man. This is my card, like my examination card with my original name and my number and my like intake number. Yeah, so wish me luck guys, yeah. Hello guys, good evening. How are you all doing? I hope that you are fine, amazing and well. Just excuse my attire for the day. Yes, for the night actually, because it's night. I believe currently it has just hit around 11. And since morning, I haven't tuned in with you. I forgot somehow. Actually, I've been remembering throughout the whole day to come back and talk to you guys. But I just got so busy and so overwhelmed by a lot of different things. The last clip that you guys saw, it was me telling you that I was going in for the paper. That was paper one to say. A uh, tropical medicine and surgery three. It was such an amazing paper. That is the truth. And uh, okay, it was not like very very easy, but it was also not very hard. So I would give it 50-50 and I know that I did my best. And probably fingers crossed, I'll, I'll have my good good grades in that paper. And they bought for us actually Ebola. Yes prevention modes of transmission of ebola how can we prevent ebola they also bought us typhoid how to prevent typhoid and uh the predisposing factor of typhoid yeah then in the evening they actually bought uh the evening it was supposed to be paper two which we actually also did do and i also forget completely to vlog but it was also amazing the part happens to have reproductive health and also uh reproductive health and what and counseling and guidance yes counseling and guidance it was also such an amazing paper there was not a lot of counseling in the paper that is the truth it was mostly reproductive health and reproductive health they just put for us pillars of safe motherhood uh, then from pillars of safe motherhood they also brought for us like uh, the cardinal signs that like the pre signs of uh, labor to show that the mother is going into labor then they also bought for us like uh, management of third stage of labor and like the likelihood complications of third, uh, third stage of labor and those part those questions that guys i'm telling you those are the questions that are um, 
in section C, like the last section, which mostly has a lot of marks. Yeah, that has been probably my day in summary. And yeah, that was an amazing day. Tomorrow happens to be Tuesday. I'm having paper three. I'll be bringing you along. And tomorrow probably I'll be doing a full vlog. Yes, full vlog. Because tomorrow is going to be the last theory paper in nursing school at the certificate level. And I want to treat it. I want to treat it. That's why I want to vlog it. Yes, I'll be doing that probably in the morning from around uh, Sawa Satu. Uh, Satu is around, it's around 9 a.m. in the morning to around uh, 12 during that day. And after that, uh, I also want to move to town, buy some things to prove that I'll be bringing you along. Yeah. So right now, guys, uh, I'm going to be reading and preparing for this paper for tomorrow. The paper I'm having tomorrow, actually, paper three, it is uh, entrepreneurship and health science management in nursing. Yes, not entrepreneurship as a course, but in nursing. So I'm going to be reading for that. And let me catch you, I believe, in the next vlog. Thank you very much for watching this one. Tanya Nishali, switching out. Bye for now.